Good morning, I'm Corey Duke. And I'm Justin Fisher. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. COVID testing centers are swamped right now. We visited one in Broken Arrow Tuesday for the third day in a row. With the surge in cases and people coming back to work and school after the holidays, the lines just continue to grow. And on that note, to hopefully cut down on wait times, the state health department is extending hours at several testing sites. The Tulsa City County Health Department is among select locations with new hours. If you need a test, you can call County Health Department, or you can dial 211. You can also make an appointment at the state's testing portal. Of course, to make it easy for you, we'd have a link to that at KGRH.com and in our free mobile app as well. And all eyes are on the CDC today as it weighs booster shots for kids ages 12 to 15. The FDA already signed off, hoping to give schools another tool as they struggle to reopen. It comes as nine states set records for kids hospitalized with COVID. And we want to get over to Annie Brown for a look at your forecast as you head out the door today. It's looking pretty cool, Annie. Absolutely. Grab the coat as you're headed out. It is January 5th. Let's talk about those temperatures as we're getting this day started. In the 30s, we'll keep the wind chills in the 30s, although you're seeing 40s by this afternoon. A few clouds building in early on, but those will make their way out. Check out these overnight lows. Yes, a cold Arctic air mass will be blasting in. We'll see temperatures out the door tomorrow morning in the teens. Not even recovering to freezing temperatures. We're staying in those mid 20s for tomorrow. 40 zone as we look towards our Saturday, we'll see those upper 50s and lower 60s in the forecast. All in all, roller coaster ride continues. A few flurries mainly north and east for tomorrow morning. Annie, thank you. That's a look at some of the stories making headlines today. Stay with Tune News Oklahoma for updates all throughout the day.